When it comes to living in a planar space, you can only turn your head for more or less 90 degrees to look up and 90 degrees to look down. Basically, your body parts can only turn within the plane, which means the rotation axis should be in parallel to the normal axis of the plane. So, there is no way that you turn your head from side to side. If you try to stand on your hands to see the object behind you upside down, still you cannot see it because your hands block the light coming from that object. One eye should be enough to live in a planar space unless your body is more cautious and evolved an additional eye on your head back. The eyes cannot be placed here to look similar to our three-dimensional world because in that case they would not receive any light rays within the plane and wouldn't see any objects around you. You're gonna have a nose with one hole that wouldn't connect to your throat because otherwise your upper jaw falls off from oh your God. head. The mouth can evolve some planar lips, teeth, and tongue. What you chew and swallow takes its way into your stomach but wouldn't exit from the other side. This is because your digestive system cannot be continuous to avoid splitting your body in half. Unfortunately, all the digestive waste from your body must be thrown away through your mouth. The ear would look like a hole on your forehead and wouldn't be efficient to be placed here because no sound waves can be perceived through the air around you. Two hands should be evolved on the same side so that you can grab, lift, pull and push objects. Instead of having left and right legs, you're gonna have front and back legs. Your feet would direct to one side. While walking, your back foot cannot pass the front foot. So it's gonna be an inconvenient walk. Technically, you cannot turn to walk back. So either you have to move backward, which is not easy, or make arrangements to evolve another pair of legs specialized to walk to the other side. 